Hey guys, this is Micromax Canvas A310, which is rebranded Coolpad F1 phone. So today I am showing a simple tutorial for those who want to install any custom recovery or any custom ROM in their Canvas Nitro A310. So to install custom recovery, first th thing we need is mobile uncle tool and recovery image obviously for your recovery image google that and uh, i have downloaded twrp version 2.4.4 download recovery.image from google uh, search it on google and uh, place it in the root of your sd card directory don't forget to add recovery in front uh, in, in the starting of the image file otherwise it will not be detected by mobile uncle tool so to install custom recovery open mobile uncle tools and click on recovery update it will show recovery in sd card click, i prefer recovery 2.4.4 so click on it okay then it will ask you to reboot your phone just reboot so your recovery will be installed and this is interface of TWRP 2.4.4 now to install custom ROM in your phone just download the .zip file and place it in your SD card or in your phone storage wherever you want I downloaded ASP, AOSP leak 4 uh, let me show you this is placed over here you can see this ASP v4 kitkat leak 17 with v3 kernel and now I am showing you how to install any custom ROM uh, to install custom ROM, go into recovery mode. Uh, first, power off your device. After your phone is switched off, press the volume up button and power button simultaneously. Just wait for the phone to reboot. Phone will reboot in recovery mode. As you can see here. Now in recovery mode, first, uh, before installing any ROM, first you need to uh, uh, back up your current ROM. For backing up your current ROM, click on this backup button. And select everything or anything yeah, or whatever you want to back up I want to back up everything so I'm just swipe here, here the option is swipe to back up and use your external SD card to back up backup will start and it will, it will take some time depending on uh, the size of uh, data to be backed up All, it's almost done yeah. and it's done now now we have option to reboot the system or we can go back if we want to do anything else so we go back now these are some options install wipe backup restore mount settings advanced and reboot now we will go click on install and go to the directory where we have downloaded the rom file for me it's here uh, this is 
use that file and click on swipe to confirm just swipe to confirm this will start it will take some time may vary from 3 to 10 minutes depending on the size of rom and you uh, do not re remove battery or do not switch off your phone while performing this operation otherwise you may hard break your phone if the operation is closed in between flashing is done as you can see this is showing successful now there we have options to go to home of twrp wipe cache or delvic and reboot the system so first we will do wipe cache or delvic now back then again go to back back and now click on wipe and do factory reset because while installing rom the previous rom data is still left in the phone we need now go back back now we don't have to do anything else to install the rom rom is installed and is fully fresh now just reboot your system As you can see, first boot up may take some time. This is normal, so don't worry about this. And don't switch off your phone during this period. Make sure it is connected to charger. The ROM is being booted. Select your language and anything else you need to select for this. Just skip. I am just skipping the setup because I just want to show how to install custom ROM. And you can see the, the ROM has been installed. If you want to restore back to your old ROM then all you have to do is switch off your phone and reboot in recovery mode again just click on this and after your phone is switched off just go to recovery mode by pressing the volume up button and, uh, with power button simultaneously Now for restoring your old ROM, click on the restore button. This will show you the ROM packages which you have backed up earlier. Uh, you have to select uh, from those. Now we have only one that is MIUI V6 by Pintutaku that we just now backed up in the previous section. Select the files you want to restore. I want to restore everything. and just here is the the, the option uh, to restore swipe to restore just swipe it and wait for the restoring process to be done Now there is option to reboot the system that means now it is showing the reboot system option and it is showing that the restore is completed successfully.
so just reboot your system you don't have to do anything else if it is prompting that fix root permissions now then swipe to fix root and it will restart you will be on your old rom old backed up rom in my case it is MIUI v6 by Pinto Tacos. you will get everything back your contacts your apps and data of your apps as you can see I am back on my own my old ROM